Hello everyone, I'm Xiang Tao from the Chinese Academy of Sciences and the University of Chinese Academy of Sciences. I'm glad to introduce our work, Semantic Evolvement Enhanced Graph Autoencoder for Rumor Detection. Nowadays, due to the rapid development of the internet, rumors spread rapidly on the internet, causing a bad impact on society and life. Therefore, there is an urgent need for a rapid and effective rumor detection method. However, the success of prior rumor detection models that introduce contrastive learning heavily relies on data augmentation. Additionally, these models lack attention to the semantic involvement during news propagation. Semantic involvement refers to the gradual transformation of the comprehensive semantics of news, including source post and all responses, as user interactions such as comments, shares, and likes increase. These comments often present diverse viewpoints due to different perspectives and positions, which contribute to the alteration of the semantic meaning of the news. In order to achieve more rapid and effective rumor detection without the need for data augmentation, we propose a novel semantic evolvement enhanced graph autoencoder for rumor detection model in our paper. Specifically, the model learned the semantic involvement information from both local and global perspectives in order to capture the local semantic changes between tweets and their responses. We utilize the features of parent nodes to reconstruct the features of their child nodes in the top-down directions and utilize the features of child nodes to reconstruct the feature of their parent nodes in the bottom-up directions. In order to capture the global semantic involvement information, we introduce a global semantic learning module by conducting features random mask reconstruction on undirected propagation graph. Furthermore, in order to enhance the model's ability to learn the distinct patterns of rumors and non-rumors, we introduce a uniformity regularizer to further improve the model's performance, which prefers the uniform distribution on the unit hypersphere by pulling away the distance between the representations of different events. That's all for our introduction. Thank you for listening.